New emergency repair work on another major Sacramento freeway. Now this, of course, all comes after large potholes damaged dozens of vehicles last month along I-5 in downtown Sacramento. Well, remember that one. Now there are similar problems reported on Highway 50. CBS 13's Angela Greenwood is live along 50, getting answers on why Caltrans is concerned. Angela? Yeah, Tony and Adrian, drivers get ready for even more delays out here. Now, on average, more than 200,000 vehicles drive this stretch of highway every single day. And crews say they want to stop potential problems before they start. It's a familiar sight on Sacramento roadways, crumbling concrete, making for a bumpy ride for many drivers. And now Caltrans is prepping for emergency road repairs on another main commute route, Highway 50. The concrete slabs that are in place now more than likely are the original concrete slabs from when the highway was first uh, built. And rather than doing a maintenance patch job or a, a pothole repair, the slabs are being removed and replace with new slabs. The work is similar to what's going on along Interstate 5 in downtown Sacramento right now. That's where dozens of drivers reported flattened tires due to potholes. After that unexpected damage, engineers turned their focus to Highway 50. So it only made sense to continue searching around. So what are the areas of concern along Highway 50? A roughly Stockton Boulevard, 65th Street, um, probably as far as, as Sacramento State. Caltrans warns there will likely be overnight lane closures once repairs begin, similar to what's happening now along I-5. Crews are hoping to complete construction before the wet weather hits. What typically happens is that water seeps through, temperature changes happen, and then you have all these potholes coming up. Caltrans says there has not been any major reports of damaged cars on Highway 50 yet, and with this work, they hope to keep it that way. This is more of a preventative measure. Well, we already know that it's happened with I-5. We don't want to take a chance on that happening with 50. And Caltrans officials say the repairs being made on I-5 are now 60% complete. And the total cost of both of these emergency repair projects is estimated at more than $6 million. Angela, thanks for that live update on the Highway 50 situation.